Hey, I like this one. Hey, yeah, I like this room here. This is different. Oh, look at that, look, look at that. That's a bit of me. So guys, welcome back to the channel. Touching down from Chiang Mai City, as always, today. Got a little treat. We're gonna look at a place that I've been to before, but I've returned with the camera many years later. And this is a cool little place. It's called Lap Cam. I will put the screen and um, put the screen up, put the name up on the screen. And it's in a quiet neighborhood, but you're only 10 minutes walking to the Night Bazaar, Bazaar and Loy Crow area. So this place is walkable into downtown. And yeah, I've been here before, two years ago. The lady showed me around and it's like a homely place, man. So this is it, the family business. I forget how many rooms she said now. I think it was like 30 or 40 rooms. So quiet here. So, so quiet. And I'll show you the road after because it's, it's like a, it's like a semi Thai neighborhood. There's some Western hotels, Western. What I mean by Western is some people do stay here, holiday makers, but it is generally a Thai neighborhood. And we are in the um, Haya district, just 10 minutes walk, like I said. And we're gonna have a little look here, man. So we've got the dog caged there, look. And you got reception here. What I like about this place, we've got this communal area with a lovely breeze, man. You can come and sit here in the evenings, in the mornings, have your um, have your breakfast, look. Nice open space. And yeah, let's go, man. So the ladies um. Doing a bit of cleaning up here, got reception here, and she lives here too, so she's always gonna be around. Got the quiet sign as well, look, that's always nice, isn't it? I think down here is where the family sort of stay, so we're gonna go up. And it does remind me of like a house, just a proper, proper family house. And the stairway and everything. And there's not a lot of people staying here at the minute. So first, we're going to look on the second floor here. We're going to look at the standard rooms. So this is one of the standards here, guys. And this is available for daily as well. I think it's 700 baht a day. And we're going to talk more about that in a bit because prices are a little bit steep here when we get to the monthlies as well but she said it is very n negotiable so yeah you can work out a price here and it's so clean this place is amazingly clean she cleans the rooms every day man just got your bathroom there nice floor nice clean toilet that's all you need, man. And then you get a small, small balcony. So this side you're overlooking some other houses. Not ideal, another hotel there, but it's never gonna be crazy, crazy noisy in this place. And that's, that's the main thing really, isn't it? So yeah, it's, it's a small balcony. You could put some washing out here, you get some sun look, where you could dry your clothes. Yeah, that's the, that's the standard room. Got your wood furniture. You get the fridge and the TV. So your wardrobe lit. And it's a real, real nice, clean, clean place. Oh, yeah, it's an odd one. Yeah, that's probably one of the hardest mattresses where I've been, I would say. So this room, a month, guys, is 7,000 baht, but it can rise to 9,000. It just depends sort of what time of year it is and how busy it is. 
it's it's negotiable. So seven seven to nine thousand, you get cleaning every day. Just like your basic um room. But as I said, the the pool of this place is the pool, I don't mean swimming pool, the actual what pools you're in about this place is just how a quiet family sort of place this is. Just a cheer place to live. So got a guy in that one, so we're not going that one. Sure, she's let me see two standards actually. This is a standard. Another standard. So same same again. I just thought I would show you a different different side. Well, same side, but couple couple up. So you're a bit closer to the other hotel in this one. Hello, boy. So this is the dog. He will bark like mad when you first get here. But once he gets to know you, it's all good. Right, so this here is, is the bigger room. The bigger apartment. So you've got a lot more space there. you got extra tables. And what I like about this room is... Yeah, big balcony. So I'm going to show you outside. So I, I am, um, I got to know this place by online. When I first come to Chiang Mai, I read up about how Frangs come and stay here all the time. One guy was saying, wherever he comes to Chiang Mai, he comes to this place. And this is just over um, the other side, back alley. Got a couple houses and look how big this this um outside is. It's massive. You could bring your chairs out here, you could bring your table. And after the sun's gone from this side, it's a real nice place to come and sit out. Balcony, can't it? I forgot it for a minute. <laughs> I was thinking, eh, I forgot the name balcony. So yes, a lovely sized balcony. You could put some other stuff out here as well. You got your aircon there. You could put maybe a washing machine. I don't know. And we've got your tables here. It is a bigger, bigger footprint. And we'll just lock it up here. And it's, it's all a wood effect here. If you like that, maybe some of you don't. So we're just gonna try this work. Yeah, they're all hard mattresses, man. But you could probably sort that out. Maybe they would change it. So you get your fridge, you get your microwave, kettle, big TV, big wardrobe. And yeah, the bathroom's a little bit bigger as well. So happy days, man, happy days. Best things about staying here, quiet, and you got that homely feel, and clean, very, very clean. So this room here, guys, this bigger room, it starts from 9,000 a month, but it can go to 12,000. So I'm gonna leave the info, as always, down below, and you can have to chat with the lady if you like this place, and. Depends on what time of year and what sort of deal you can strike with that. So yeah, that's that's one of the bigger rooms. So I think we can look at one higher up, where there's the better view, the view of the mountain, which I thought I would show you. Now we're here. Yeah, so quiet. There's Pantit Plaza there. That's Pantit Plaza. And there's Loy Crow Roglet. There's all the um, hotels, Loy Crow. So you can walk it. Easy. It'll just take you 10, 10 minutes. Got a lady down there setting up. Setting up the room. Is this the one she set up for me? I forget now, man. Yeah, this one. This one here. So this is another bigger room. 
but you're all, you've got a mountain view here and just different side layout it's nice man it, it really is nice well maintained and nice and clean and big chunky desk that would be ideal for me that would live in here tempted myself again i nearly moved in this place so you've got your bathroom look there he is happy days got your new style sink shower no divider but you can't have everything can you yeah so this room is nine to twelve thousand again you would have to um strike up a deal and look at this look it's not a bad way to come out and eat your brekkie in the morning is it got the road over there and have a quiet road that is i'm always in this area and see this hotel over here we've done a review on there about a year and a half ago i was over there that one was even more expensive than here this one i would say this one's a lot better because that is just more you like run of the mill hotel here it's just that little bit different coming out in the morning tally ho <laughs> yeah i could get used to this this would be ideal man ideal so close to town as well in the evenings stroll into night bazaar food court get some grub so yeah with the price here you've got to pay just electric i think she said everything else is included the um water is included and the cleaning and i think the bedding the bedding and everything if you wanted to save some money you could take away all that and save a bit of money um, i think she said it's one month's deposit which is same everywhere right you've always got to pay that one month's deposit there you go lap cam house put the old flippies on right so a lady just said we can um have a, we've got the cleaner here look she's already cleaning which is always a good sign wow like this one hey i like this one hey yeah i like this room here this is different oh look at that look look at that that's a bit of me so this room is you face in the front gate and again it wouldn't be too noisy because not a lot of people go down this road as a motorbike goes past nice big balcony look at the size of that aircon as well sit out here so when i came here last time this room was taken so this is one of the um one of the more top rooms i think yeah i like this one it's big man maybe you could change that you could sit here and eat your dinner or whatever right, so this is the same this is a big big room so so nine to twelve thousand guys i really like this one yeah really like it yeah another hard mattress but you can't have everything it's a shame like there's not there's not a dedicated kitchen here that would probably like this is perfect isn't it for a kitchen area that would be amazing that would be perfect there you go guys nine thousand to twelve thousand a month yeah i'm gonna be truthful i i said to her mm, maybe a bit cheaper man if you if you bring it down a bit you would get more people here but it's not my business my opinion maybe one or two thousand a little bit too high maybe if this was like eight eight or nine thousand you couldn't really grumble with this place i don't think oh yeah not showing the bathroom here same again a little bit bigger than the other one i'd say this is like one of the main deluxe deluxe rooms so very nice maybe i'd prefer to be around the back where people are not in your face when they come out of the room but it's a nice it's a nice room man 
this is the bit I really like as well. It's massive down here, look. Massive, man. Yeah, I'd be chilling out down here, bring the laptop down. I'd bring the laptop down here. Me and the lady were just sitting here, having some water, look. So just show you down the front again. Um, the owner, she didn't want to be on camera. She said, I will tell you everything first and then you are free to, free to walk around. Yeah, see that's the room we were just in, the nice one right here. So you would be right on the front like that. And I'll show you out the front in a minute. We'll have a little walk down the road there. Just so you get an idea of the place. See, one of the other ones I was in, I would prefer the one down there maybe. Down the end of the quiet driveway here. So I'll just show you some of the outside guys. So this is the outside. She's got the, um, she's got a sign up, look, room for rent, telephone number, lap cam house. Yeah, really enjoyed it. She's a nice lady and some great rooms in there. We got a house in there. I thought that was a hotel. She said it was an house. So just walk to the end of the road and I will sort of show you what direction things are in. See, it's down a really quiet Sawyer. You got your traditional little Thai families living right next door. Always like how they got that washing out and I love little streets like that. That's what my streets like as well. Proper proper toilet. <laughs> got all the stuff outside. Ording. That is a big Ording. <clears throat> yeah so here guys you just take a right and you walk down into into downtown down here 10 minutes you walk down you end up in Chang Clan Road you end up at Night Bazaar got a grab driver outlet and up here you got a small temple and you got loads of food little small places on the side of the road as well so you would come in from downtown say you was walking five minutes you would walk up here you turn off down this road, happy days, there's your gaff. So the girl I was speaking to, Jen from America, who, who stays in here, she walks as well. So she's staying here and walks, walks around everywhere. So it's perfect. Depends what sort of area you like. Truthful, it is a little bit overpriced and I told her that, but it is a beautiful place. And I'm gonna stop waffling and go and get some grub, mate. So I am absolutely Hank Marvin. Hope you like the little tour around this different place. Not everybody's cup of tea, maybe a little bit costly for some people, maybe still cheap, right? Still cheap, but it's clean and you're paying for just that different style and feel of a homely place with nobody around hardly. I'm going to stop waffling. Hope you're all safe and sound as always. And I will see you in the next one. So take it easy, man. Take it easy.